Hi guys, welcome back to another part of MySQL tutorial. In this part, we are going to learn how to create and manage MySQL database in MySQL Server. So go to the Start menu and choose All Programs and select MySQL and MySQL Server and here is the MySQL Server command line client choose that okay now the command prompt is open now you need to specify the root password here so I type the root password and hit enter now you are successfully logging into MySQL server so before do anything with the MySQL server you need to create a database in MySQL server so here is the syntax of creating a database in MySQL server create database database name my database here my database name is my database and handed that statement with a semicolon now hit enter now the server show that one row is actually affected and the query is ok that means now the database is successfully created in the MySQL server so for checking whether the database is created or not you can see all the databases available in MySQL server using this statement show databases this statement will show you all the available database in MySQL server now hit enter now you can see that actually there are one two three four five databases are present the second one is the database that we are recently created so that database is actually successfully created on MySQL server so if you want to work with any of these databases you need to you need to choose that database so here is the syntax of choosing a database here is the syntax use database name here my database name is my database one more thing here you can see that actually I name that database here is the here is the command create database here you can see that M is caps and D is also in capital letter but in database you can see that all all the letters of that database name all are in small letters that means database name table name or the syntax that means query syntax is not case sensitive in MySQL so here is the syntax of changing the database use and database name here database name is my database and hit enter now you can see that the server will return a message called database change that means now we are currently in my database okay if you want to delete or drop a database from MySQL server here is the syntax for drop or delete a database from MySQL server the syntax is drop database name drop database and database name here my database name is my database and end with a semicolon now hit enter again it will return query ok that means now the database is successfully that database that means my database is now successfully dropped from this MySQL server so for checking it just just use this index show databases now you can see that that database is missing that means it is dropped from MySQL server guys these are the syntax of creating and managing a database in MySQL server please subscribe my channel now for getting more video updates thank you for watching see you in the next part of this tutorial